Like and subscribe right now, or this spider will crawl on your face while you're sleeping. The Earth itself isn't the only oldest thing that has stood the test of time. Archaeologists over the years have found loads of other old man-made objects that have left us bewildered. That being said, today we'll be getting into the 10 oldest man-made objects ever found. Number 10. Oldest Footwear a very well-preserved shoe was found in a cave in Armenia, along with a horde of other artifacts from the Copper Age. This shoe was later revealed to be the oldest example of footwear ever discovered. This 5,500-year-old 5, moccasin-like shoe was made from a single piece of cowhide leather and was rubbed with a plant or vegetable oil. It also contained shoelaces, which were crisscrossed through a series of holes just like you'd see in today's sneakers. The shoe was about as big as a U.S. woman's size 7 and was likely custom made for the right foot of its owner, who, judging by the high level of craftsmanship, was probably quite a wealthy person. Before we move on, I've got a little challenge for you that'll take five seconds to complete. So here's the deal. You just leave a like on this video, smash that subscribe button, and hit the notification bell, and you'll get 25 years of amazing luck. Try it. It really works. Number 9. Oldest Masks These 9,000-year-old artifacts were made by the early farmers of the Judean Hills region and were painstakingly carved from stones. There's actually a historical significance to these artifacts, given how the immediate ancestors of the prehistoric farmer craftsmen in Levant were the ones who planted the seeds of human civilization by making the transition from hunting and gathering to introducing a range of founder crops. And beyond just chronological significance, these ancient Neolithic masks are also a testament to the development of culture and religion, as the objects probably symbolize the spirits of dead ancestors, and so were probably used in Stone Age rituals. But of course, we are in no way denying the sense of eeriness that seems to exude from these Neolithic masks. It is their simplicity that may seem to be more intimidating, as archaeologists had also come across clumps of hair that were stuck to some of the masks, but were later removed. So, in a way, all of the masks represented adult males, with each mask originally having a set of facial hair, including a beard, mustache, and possibly even hair. And to make it even creepier, the masks might have been modeled on actual human skulls of old men, which is probably what gives them the realistic contours of the prominent cheeks, temples, eye sockets, and even the bared teeth. Number 8. Oldest Dress the Tarkhan dress has not only been declared to be Egypt's oldest garment, but is also assumed to be the oldest surviving piece of woven clothing in the world. According to researchers, the dress was previously a fashionable linen garment, having knife-pleated sleeves and a bodice with a naturally beautiful pale gray stripe design. The lower part of the dress is missing, which is why its original length is not known. Speaking of the dress, one of the researchers said that the survival of highly perishable textiles in the archaeological record is incredibly rare, and the survival of whole or almost whole articles of clothing like the Tarkhan dress is even more remarkable. It was always assumed that the dress dated back to the first dynasty, but it was never confirmed as the sample previously needed for testing would have caused too much damage to the dress. To determine the age of the Tarkhan dress, a team of researchers analyzed a small sample of the garment in an attempt to measure the amount of radioactive isotope of carbon still present in the linen. As linen is made of flax fibers, it is quite easy to test via radiocarbon dating. According to the team, the dress contains signs of wear and tear dating back to when it was still new and was likely worn by a teenager or perhaps a very slim woman. Number 7. Oldest Musical Instruments in 2012, researchers identified what now holds the title as the oldest known musical instruments in the world. The two flutes were made from mammoth ivory and bird bone, which, through carbon dating, was revealed to be approximately 43,000 years old. These were found in a cave in southern Germany and are now regarded as early evidence for the occupation of Europe by modern humans. 
It's been suggested by some scientists that our ancestors had a number of advantages over Neanderthals that gave them an edge and helped them survive to modern times. Music might have been one of the ways Homo sapiens socialized and formed communities. Reportedly, these findings are consistent with a hypothesis made several years ago that said that the Danube River was a vital passageway for the movement of humans and technological innovations into Central Europe 45,000 years ago. Number 6. Oldest Payslip Mesopotamia boasts an incredible legacy in relation to many of civilization's firsts. One of them is a 5,300-year-old tablet that was originally found from the city of Uruk, which is in present-day Iraq. On it was an inscription using the pictorial language of cuneiform. This artifact shows a human head eating from a bowl and drinking from a conical vessel. The bowl represents a ration while the conical glass is a reference to the consumption of beer. Besides that, the tablet is also marked with scratches that essentially record the quantity of beer assigned to each worker. In other words, this artifact is the world's oldest known payslip that shows how the hierarchical system of workers and employers was in place even five millennium ago, and they were probably connected by the exchange of beer before money was invented. What this tells us is that despite the absence of a full-fledged currency system, the employers came up with an ingenious method of paying their workers. How clever was that? Number 5. Oldest Swiss Army Knife This ancient multi-tool was found in the Mediterranean in the early 1990s and isn't of Swiss origin, but looks as though it was the beginning of a Swiss Army Knife. This contraption comes from the 2nd century Roman Empire and, based on its features, was primarily used for eating. It includes a spike that is believed to have been used to pluck snails out of their shells, and a hook-like spatula that might have been used to get sauce out of bottles. The tool also comprised of a knife, fork, and spoon for eating with, as well as a small pick to help users dig any food remnants out of their teeth. Surprisingly, all of these seem to fold into the handle of the knife to help keep everything compact and prevent people from accidentally injuring themselves, just like modern-day Swiss Army knives. Number 4. Oldest Bow Although arrowheads have been found dating back as far as 61,000 years ago that were made of bone in a cave in South Africa, wooden bows are a lot more prone to decay. The oldest known complete bow ever found is the Holmegaard bow, which turned up in a peat bog in Denmark after the Second World War. It was made from a thin elm trunk and is on display at the National Museum in Copenhagen. Number 3. Oldest Purse Archaeologists uncovered more than a hundred dog teeth neatly aligned in a grave that dates back to roughly 2500 BC, after they excavated a site near Leipzig, Germany. According to archaeologist Suzanne Friedrich, the teeth were most likely used as decorations for the outer flap of an ancient purse. The handbag's main material was probably either leather or textile, but over the years, the leather or fabric disappeared and all that's left are the teeth. It seems that canine teeth were really trendy 4,500 years ago, adorning everything from blankets to clothing to jewelry. However, considering the amount of teeth on the purse and the intricacy of the item indicates that the owner held a high status. And with that, it's now time for today's subscriber pick. Today's photo was sent to us by one of our subscribers. If you come across a photo online and want to know more details about it, just send it on over to us. Who knows, we might even feature it on a future video. Number 2. Oldest Prosthetic A false toe was found alongside Egyptian mummies buried 3,000 years ago and is now believed to be the oldest prosthetic device in existence. The fake toe, which was made out of wood and leather, had been buried with a woman who might have lived between 950 BC and 710 BC, and it looks as though it was more of a practical walking device rather than a prosthetic. Researchers made a replica of the wooden toe and gathered volunteers with missing toes to test it out, wearing the same kind of sandals that were worn in ancient Egypt. From the data gathered by pressure sensors, it was found that it would have been very difficult for an ancient Egyptian missing a big toe to walk around normally wearing traditional sandals. So, 
It is assumed that wearing these false toes would have made walking around in a sandal a lot more comfortable. Number 1. Oldest Complaint This clay artifact in question really just shows that people back then were no different than us. It is of Babylonian origin dating back to 1750 BC and is currently being kept in the British Museum. As for the inscription, the passage details quite a scathing customer complaint from one person to another. A person named Nani was unhappy about a copper shipment from a merchant named Ea Nazir. So, he carved out a long letter one day on a clay tablet, explaining that he'd been promised fine quality ingots and wasn't happy about the ones that had been delivered. This incredible tablet was originally discovered at the site of Ur, which was one of the Sumerian city-states, now in southern Iraq, that had already lost its power during the 18th century BC, while being under Babylonian rule. And that concludes our list of the 10 oldest man-made objects ever found. Let us know in the comment section below what your thoughts were on today's video. And as always, don't forget to like, subscribe, and click the bell icon.